Hello, this is Daniel and this is an update on Pata's rigging tools. First off, I've made a few changes to the interface. I've separated the operator list into three categories, which are character, waiting, and cleanup. Also, I've added hints about what sort of uh, selections the operators are meant to be used on. So for example, on the cleanup category, we see zero selected. So this gives us a hint that these operators work on all selected objects. On the waiting category, we see only the active object's name, and this gives us a hint that the waiting operators only work on the active object. The character operators are special in the sense that they work on the entire character. A character is defined by all objects parented to a rig. So in this case, the rig is called Steve rig, which is this object. So it doesn't matter if I select the t-shirt or the pant, the character will always be Steve rig. Now onto the new operators. The first one is a lock transforms operator that will work on all selected objects and just makes sure that all of the objects have all of their transforms locked. I've added this because even if we can use the alt and drag trick, it can be a little bit unreliable since, for example, if I accidentally alt drag from a channel that is already locked, I'm actually unlocking all other objects. Also, there's another corner case, which I don't like, and it's if one of the objects rotation is set to quaternion and I copy from an object that is set to XYZ Euler, for example, then I'm probably missing the W component. So I just like this operator that always makes sure that all selected objects are locked. The second new operator is toggle modifiers, and this one works on the entire character. And it's meant to be a replacement of Simplify since I got tired of the limitations of the Simplify tool. Let's try it out with any of the objects selected that compose a single character. The toggle modifiers operator will toggle all the modifiers in all of the meshes that belong to this character. You can select which of the modifiers you want to toggle, and the options right now are subdivision, multi-res, displace, solidify, cloth, soft body, particles, and smooth. And smooth actually includes things like corrective smooth and any other kinds of smoothing. So let's try it out. And as you can see, we are toggling the corrective smooth and the subdivision at the same time on all the meshes of the character. I've been using this operator a lot, not only during weight painting, but also during shape key editing. So for example, if I want to see the effect of the modifiers during shape key editing, I can quickly toggle modifiers here. Also super useful when posing the character. And of course, during weight painting. So that's it for now. I hope you enjoy Pata's rigging tools. And thanks go to Jorge, our Pata's animation character modeler, for the great character.